to keep a healthy relationship my dear there is no perfect relationship out there don't be deceived there is just an healthy relationship i know couple of them which mine is part of them so here are some tips that i use that is working for me which i'm very sure that it will definitely work for you if you apply it in your relationship first of all communicate effectively learn to communicate effectively communication is very important in an healthy relationship your girlfriend is not a witch your boyfriend is not a wizard they can't know what is going on if you do not talk about it so learn to communicate then do a regular maintenance ask questions maybe out of the blues ask your partner what have i been doing that he does not like or what would your partner want you to do better and you ask him the same question then he ask you the same question i think with that you know what you are doing then another thing have a ritual <laughs> like maybe if your partner wants to go out to kiss you all or you should have something that it is a routine that you do every day in your relationship do you understand so with that it will keep you to check then adjust your expectation high expectation in a relationship can destroy a beautiful relationship so my dear adjust your expectation then also plan surprises for each other surprise your partner man to love gifts forget it even though it might not be that expensive gift some people will say eh, i'm richer my my husband is my partner my boyfriend my husband is richer than me his own money is one of my own money yes we know but with that little that you are earning try to surprise like he's not necessarily you buy the whole world do you get but let him know that you are thoughtful of him you have him in mind and also go for dates which is once in a month once in weeks just go for dates that time you know that today oh i'm not eating house food you are going out to enjoy yourself and in that day don't press your phone set your phone aside like it will be you and your partner moment and also learn to compromise compromisation is very important in an healthy relationship yeah so learn to compromise that's why know your deal breaker so what is the extent you can go some people they don't eat certain food and their partner does what they do is they find a way to adjust it like they don't necessarily need to eat that food but they make sure they provide that food for their partner do you understand so learn to compromise and as you are growing let your partner grow with you if you are going to a church invite your partner to the church if you are going to a seminar or you are listening to a message or a podcast share it with your partner share reels talk about things read books together watch movies together so there are some things that you are you you've learned and you really want your partner to know about that thing then you do what you introduce it to that your partner and also support each other ah you should be your partner's number one fan yes it should be your partner number one fan so support each other and lastly know when where and how to seek for help sometimes even though it is not advisable to involve a third party into your relationship but sometimes some day something might happen some day might come in which you need a help so know when where how to seek for help i hope this is helpful see you in my next video please like share subscribe to my youtube channel thank you peace out